Welcome to a video from the Dislife.com. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use the Behringer Selena String Ensemble, which is this amazing sounding string machine, recreation of string machine from the 70s. I'm going to show you how you can use that to modulate and to, as a send effect to other synthesizers, drum machines. So, I'll show you how I've got it wired up and we'll have a listen to it. So, what you're hearing now is this thing like string machine. Beautiful sound, that's just the modulation of the phaser, that's just and that's the drive sound without the So what we can use is these two effects with existing kit. So how have we done it? Right. Well you've got two inputs. You've got a modulate, a modulation in and phaser in. I've got a auxiliary send from a mixer uh, into this mini jack cable. You don't have to do it that way. What you can do is you can just take the straight audio out of any of your devices to audio in you need a mini jack but like this drum machine so you know drum is mini jack anyway so you can have mini jack to mini jack straight in and then it puts the effects out you can either take them directly out through the modulation out and phaser out or it goes out through the main output as well so for example now if I get a dry organ sound there or my Nord I plug it in to the mod in and then what happens is you lose the if you you lose the Selena strings because that is using the mod, so it's kind of taking that away out of the main mix, so I've lost the internal sounds. But now, if I get my organ sound, so there's the dry mix. If I increase the send, there you can hear the modulation. Now, what I found works better if you get something like uh, a DX7 and FM type sounds. So let's take um, a string sound from from the uh, TX7. So there we've got the TX7 sound through the mod. And drop a bit of reverb on there as well. Send out, it's out, and that's in. Now we can do the same thing with the phaser. So to the send to the phaser, to the phaser on. Now, make it the phaser on. Like I said before, as soon as you start to use it, it takes the, the output away so uh, from the original thing. So you can't use the strings and the uh, phaser at the same time, so you have the string machine and as a, as a send effect at the same time. So let's try it with some uh, drums now. So here's a you know, drum pan. Let's do the phaser. So let's get a bit more on the phaser. There you go. So you get some really nice effects using the string assembly, just using the audio input. So it's as simple as that. Just plug it in. You do lose the string sounds as you're using those, but you just use it as an external effect. And of course, like I said earlier, you've got the ins and outs, so you can actually have this as, de as a dedicated phaser, a dedicated modulator, just using those combination of cables. But for me, it was pretty easy just to run that cable like that. So that's a really nice use of the um, of the string ensemble just for an extra thing. But of course, 
what Dead Things with beautiful string sounds have. As you can hear now. But it's a great little modulation unit. If you want to hear more of the Selena string ensemble, I've got a separate video all about that as well. Thanks for watching this video. I'll see you on the next one.